Hi, I'm here today to review Dowin's, um, their six pack of porcelain cereal bowls. So these are the bowls. You get a set of six, so they do have them available in a set of two, um, and single bowls, or you can get a set of six with the pretty green flower that leaves the rest still to be decorated. So even though these are great bowls, they're microwavable safe, oven safe, dishwasher safe, um, FDA approved, porcelain, lead free, they're Great quality bowls. This is how they all arrived. I'm actually doing these um, for the whole point of being able to customize your own product, you know, more of an artsy feel for it. So you really can't, I mean, get better than this because you have the flat front just under five inches wide, my set is, and then um, a little over three inches tall. So I ordered the bowls. Um, I did get these as, as, um, as a sample to review for the customizable portion but or the set of bowls and then I went ahead and bought with my own money a set of um markers um I actually have a blue one too which rolled off the table so but um a set of these markers and the brand I ordered after doing a lot of re you know I read a lot of reviews because I haven't used them before personally are the PBO porcelain um china paint markers and so these don't really wipe off so what you're going to do is you're going to get your bowl and then you're going to go ahead and draw a design on it like this. Um, I did, I took my dry erase marker because the dry erase comes right off. So let me show you. You go and just make whatever design you want. If you want a scribble, then that's fine. But it wipes right off. So you can draw, take it off, draw, take it off. Because in the first few times you might not like your design. But I have... Two, I'm going to go ahead and do a shark fin design on. This one's a little messed up. I already touched it, messed it up, bringing it over here. And then what you do after that is then you take your marker, which you have to, um, if you get the marker and not the paint, you really have to start it. You shake, shake it. It's just like um, a liquid chalk pen starting those. You got to shake it, push the tip down, shake it, shake it, push the tip down. And so what I did is I kept a paper plate handy and then I kept pushing the tip down on there. And then if you let it sit, it starts to clog up also. So then you have to shake it again and push the tip down. That's all you have to do. It's pretty easy. So then you, you let this sit for a little bit and then you go ahead and you take your marker or paintbrush. You go over the design and these have set. I haven't baked these in the oven yet, but it gets like right into the porcelain within minutes. So about 10 minutes, you know, you can actually touch it, but I waited a good 30 minutes because I was phobic, <laughs> right? And then you go ahead and you take your um, paper towel cloth and you go right over it and it takes off the dry erase marker that is under the pen. So it worked out really well that way. So I have two that I'm going to um, bake in the oven tomorrow because you have to wait 24 hours with the pen and you bake it. So I have two of the squid designs and then I'm going to do two of the shark fin. And then um, I haven't really made up my mind for what I'm going to do for the third design yet. So we'll see about those. But it's a fun way to customize your own bowls. So you can do, you know, get a bottle of wine, get the ladies over, do your own paint your own bowl type of party. Get all the markers or the, or the paint brushes. I think the markers are a lot easier to handle, especially if you're drinking and having a lot of fun. You can have your kids personalize their own bowls. Um, you can do it for weddings. You can write the couple's name on it you know, very fancy in the date as a um, takeaway gift, a special occasion at the party. You're having a lot of company over. You can customize the bowl and then um, each family member, you know, each family, they could take a bowl home, you know, with snacks or something in there as, um, as a memento. There's so much you can do. You know, your kids are older. They have sleepovers. You know, the girls come over g g giggling and playing. They can do their own bowls, um, bachelor parties, whatever, just you can customize it for pretty much anything. You can get a set. And um, if you want to make your own candy bowls for all the holidays, you can do one for Halloween. You can do one for Christmas, one for Easter, you know, one for Kwanzaa, it, one for Hanukkah, whatever holiday you want to do. You can have fun, decorate it just for whatever reason. Or if you just like to decorate, getting them in a set um, is pretty inexpensive. And then you can just decorate them anytime. Um, so with the markers, now that I've gone from this, to my dry erase drawing, you know, whoops, dry erase drawing. <laughs> and then, you know, I did the pen right over it and got my octopus, you know, 
design type of situation and then you wipe it off after about 30 minutes and then you let this sit like again 24 hours then you bake it in the oven about 380 degrees Fahrenheit or if you don't want to use your oven at all you can go ahead and and let it sit for 72 hours before washing and using it so but like I said it's already etched in there the marker just sets right in it's pretty amazing how easy it is and because the bowls are such great quality um, it really takes it beautifully so it's a lot of fun. Again, I love the square modern design. You can see the, the great finish and the quality of the bowl. And this is the Dowan, D-O-W-A-N, the six pack porcelain square um, cereal bowls are 20.3 ounces. So um, I really love them. They're easy to craft on. They're great to personalize. So, you know, enjoy and have fun. Thanks.